happy to have recovered Richard's letter, Snow White smiles again. But Jolly jealously feels that she does not care for him as she should. Meanwhile, the wicked Queen Christel tries to kill Snow White again, this time with a poisoned ribbon. The princess, unaware of her stepmother's diabolical plan, finds the ribbon and ties it around her waist and immediately becomes unconscious. The seven dwarfs, extremely upset, try to revive her, but the lovely princess seems unable to hear them. Let me try to feel her heartbeat. It's the only way to know if she has a chance to live. have to happen. Huh? Snow White's favorite flower. Huh? Oh. What can this be? What? A poisonous snake? Yes, I've analyzed the liquid. It is a powerful animal poison with added mortal chemical substances. A really strange poison. What are you thinking, Chamomile? That's not normal. Something's wrong, man. Hmm? Only Queen Crystal could be able to do such an atrocity. Do you think? Could Queen Crystal really do it? I don't have any proof, but I suppose so. We can find that out later. For the time being, we need to discover a way of saving Snow White. Yeah, you're right, boss. Ah! What? I think it's time we took a look at the Book of Knowledge. Excellent idea! The Book of Knowledge contains all there is to know about everything in the world. Since it is written in an old language that's difficult to understand, the dwarfs almost don't use it. If I'm reading this correctly, it's really hard to understand what it says. Hmm. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna go see how Snow White is doing. It's uh, useless. Uh, uh, Maybe this was meant to be her fate. It's so unfair. She was just so young. So young and so full of life. you could forgive me. Oh, Snow White, forgive me, please. <laughs> Jolly? Oh, yes, boss? I'm going to the mine. What? It's time to get back to work. What? Right now? The other dwarfs are really sad, and no one is willing to go with me. Of course they're not. Does this mean you're not going to come with me either? How can you talk about work right now? We can't cry over a dead friend like Snow White forever. I know it's hard, but those who are still alive must take care of their duties. How selfish! Huh. 
Hey, are you gonna eat your favorite bread? I made it especially for you, Jolly. We have no strength to eat anything, and by the looks of it, I can see that you don't either. Oh, I am surprised with Boss's behavior. So am I. I believe he has no heart. Where are you going, Chamomile? <laughs> I'm going to read the book myself. Perhaps maybe the boss didn't read it right. <laughs> My friends, it's terrible. Tell us, what's up, Chamomile? The boss, he lied to us. How? Explain it to us. He's not at the mine. He's in the woods of life. Huh? He's, He's at, at the, the woods, woods of, of life? life? The forest of the trees of life is an extremely important place for all dwarves. When they are born, a tree is planted in the forest. Thus, the trees grow at the same time as the dwarfs. And when a dwarf dies, its corresponding tree also dries up. That is why it is called the forest of the trees of life. To recover the life of a beloved person, you must sacrifice your own. Well, that means that boss will... Boss is sacrificing himself so Snow White can live. What's sacrificing? What does it mean? Tell me, Woody. It means he's cutting down his tree of life. What? But if he does that, he will he will die.
What do you think we should do now? We must do something. Yes, certainly. But what? Woody, where are you going? Where else? To the works of life, of course. Wait, I'm coming too. Uh, <clears throat> to enter the woods of life, you need to know the secret key. Do you know it? No, but it's in the book. Therefore, I'll take it with me. You stay here to take care of Snow White. Uh -oh. huh? Hey, wait for me. Woody, Goldie, wait up, man. These are Goldie's and Woody's tree. Goldie, you're very strong. Please protect the others from danger. Woody, always try to be nicer. You, Gourmet, keep up the great work with your cuisine. Chamomile, take good care of the others. You're a good doctor. This one is Jolly's tree, and this one is Vet's. Above all, take care of yourselves, my children, and be very kind. Huh? That's Boss's pig. You're right. He must be here. Come on, hurry. We must stop him. My friends. It's too late. But No, boss! I don't believe he did it. He was our beloved leader. Woody, Chamomile, what do we do now? Oh, I know. I know what to do. We'll start by doing something with the wood of his tree. That's a good idea. What for? We need to keep it as a memento to our beloved boy. Mm. Snow White, I have behaved like a complete idiot. Again, boss is in the woods and I said he was selfish. Hmm? My goats are depressed too and they won't eat. Today, they didn't even produce one bit of milk. It is normal. They're as sad as we are, Vet. Uh huh? Huh? Uh? Boss! Uh? What 
did you have to die? Why? So Snow White could live again. <laughs> but she's still dead. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, it's you, Camomile. Where is Boss? Here, but in a different way. Uh? You see, we used the wood from Boss's tree for a new cover for the book, Jolly. Now he's in the book soul, man. In this way, he'll stay with us forever and ever. Uh, Jolly! Boss! May they both rest in peace. Snowflake? It's all this old book's fault! Huh? <laughs> uh, Jolly, come back! Uh, 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 Boss has left us now! And all because of this book! And Snow White hasn't come back to life yet, either. This book is full of nonsense! Oh, hey, wait, wait, wait. wait! Jolly, don't do that! That's Boss's book! We must destroy this terrible book! If it were not for it, Boss would still be alive with us! Uh, oh. 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 <laughs> ah, but Boss, you're alive! Boss, he's alive! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? I am the spirit of Boss's Tree of Life. Huh? I have been sacrificed, but becoming the cover of the Book of Knowledge has returned me once again to life. I revive, and with me, Boss revives. He will live as long as this book exists. Snow White will be saved as I have given my life for hers. Huh? Oh. Oh. Huh? Alive. Snow White is alive! Snow White is alive! Snow White's alive! Snow White is alive! What in the world is wrong with you all? Do I look dead? <laughs> Everything is as it should be. Peace and joy have returned to the dwarf's little family. The sun goes down, and it is time to go back home. 